I wanted to ask you, last season we ended on a crazy cliffhanger. What can you tell us about how things are going to go for Mulder when the series starts this season? Well, obviously a bit better, you know, because he was in bad shape at the end of the last season. So, you know, a lot of a lot of what we do at the end and the beginning of seasons takes our characters into extreme jeopardy, right? And then you got to get them out, and then you can get back to doing the show that you do. You know, so it's... I think our show is is best when you know Mulder and Scully are investigating whatever whatever stories they're doing rather than just being the focal point of whatever jeopardy they're supposed to be in. Absolutely. And you have actually starred on two revival shows. We've got you on X-Files and Twin Peaks. Why do you think now is the time that all these great shows are finally getting a chance to come back? I don't know. I think there's it's not just great shows, it's some pretty crappy shows that have also come back. So I, I don't know, there's a real nostalgia for, you know, people grow up watching television, or at least they, they used to, they probably still do. Um, and I think they, they have a hunger for their childhoods or for catching up with old friends in a way. But uh, I don't think of our, our uh, incarnation this time around like that. That would, that would be depressing to me. So, because I, I, I can just think of it as, as trying to tell new stories in an entertaining way, in a, in a time that makes sense. And years ago, you said you were never going to do the con circuit, that it would be 20 years, and then 20 years exactly later, you did your first New York Comic Con. So how has the con experience treated you? Well, I want to get credit for being a man of my word. Um, it's very interesting. I never, I never dreamed, I never thought that anything like this would exist when we started doing the X-Files. Um, I would kind of chafe against the idea that it was science fiction, because to me, that's what Star Trek was, or that's what shows that took place in outer space were like. And I was like, well, we're more of a procedural, we're more of a realistic show. Um, but now there's no, there's no line, there's, there's no difference. And, and the, the shows that come to Comic-Con are, are, they're all shows, you know, so it's kind of, uh, not something that I ever saw coming, so I'm, I'm a surprise. I'm surprised. I'm sure there. I'm sure everybody here is not. But uh, you guys rule now. <laughs>